Happy Tuesday. Personal but not personal. That, I don't know if someone gifted me that idea. Well, someone did. I don't know if they explained it to me the way I understand it to be for myself today. I don't, anyway. Personal but not personal. If I'm in a situation with another person, it doesn't matter the relationship. If they say or do something to me, it might not be about me. The chances of them truly trying to victimize me, then it would be personal to me and about me. And the argument can be made that even when it is an attack at you, it's not about you and it's not something you consciously participated in antagonizing. A robbery is about you but not about you. Like, does that make sense? It helps me and maybe it doesn't help you step out of victim. And it also engages a whole nother place of like, oh, okay, maybe this was a lesson that I could, maybe there's a lesson I could take from this situation. And for me, I love the idea that maybe somewhere beyond the, the known, I've set this particular situation up so I could learn if I choose to. And that's, you know, back, 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 out, zooming out, zooming out, zooming out. But it, I, yeah, I believe that. If life is math and it's all math, then why couldn't that equation work within the confines of this large equation of life, universe? We understand so very little. And we reverse engineer just about everything. And that's reverse engineering a situation where we're affected just the same. But it also engages empathy because if it's raining outside and I take the, the weather personally, when the weather has nothing to do with me, it has to do with the temperature and a bunch of stuff that I don't understand. <laughs> it has to do with nature. But if, so if I, that's not about me. It's personal to me if I'm getting wet, but it's not personal to me. It's not happening just to me. It gives me a tiny bit, it helps me claim my part in the world and in my life. That I'm not a victim of, of, very rarely do I have to be a victim every day, all day. And I have suffered and chose the role of victim for a long time, and still do. You know, there are still times where I find myself ringing the victim bell and wanting sympathy and all these things, which are very human. And I'm flawed. I'm not ever gonna be perfect. As much as I live in the delusion at times that I'm gonna be perfect, then I'm like, oh yeah, just the same. Uncovered, discovered, discard. I'm going to talk about this again, but I, I love it. I, like Life is about me, but not about me. And if you think it's about you and about you, <laughs> you got to check your ego somewhere because it's not. Like, it's not. We're all players in this. We are all a part of this. We are all this illusion of separation is just amazing. And I think we've set it up this way to have this beautiful, spiritual, human experience. So, <sighs> opportunities. Breath, gratitude, empathy, compassion, love, unconditional. Personal, but not about you. Big light, much love. Happy Tuesday.